Yep. Yeah. And we're, we're set. set. All right, here we go. Hey, hey 2018. 2018. What were you going to say? I was going to say we're outside. 2018 World of Concrete. Sunny. And we have Glenn Clausen with us, who just built this 40 by 70 something. 40 by 70 footprint. Uh, multiple high walls. So this is a decorative concrete outdoor booth, tons of finishes, decorative concrete going over. Box blocks. And look at all the people inside. We're going to try to wade through there and bring you for a walk through and we'll see what they're all doing onto the Fox blocks. Every one of these buildings was done with Fox blocks. We built them in two and a half days, just two of us. It was crazy and, and windy, but we got it done. We were successful. I need a scan No, you don't. Sis. Marilyn Lemon. Marilyn Lemon. She scanning badges, doing a great job. There and over there is Chris Sanders and uh, Jason Morgan with J&E Masonry. Chris, say hello. Hello. And Chrissy. Chrissy, say hello. Jason. Hello. So this is one of the uh, premier Texas uh, commercial grade ICF subcontractors in the market. Come along with us. We're going to go for a ride. Come on. We're follow the arrows. Yeah. Look down here. We got to follow the arrows. They're doing all kinds of stamped concrete and ground concrete. They did all kinds of standing in there. How's it going? It's going well. The Fox corner blocks cut for the opening and then Fox bucks put on them uh, quick and easy. Sill. They did a concrete windowsill and here they peeled it. Now this is made for, for kitchen countertops, but here they needed a place to show it so they're using our windowsills to show it. And you can see all the way through they've opened them up. And this is what it looks like if you look over here. This is one that hasn't been done yet. Just got to watch your footing. This, this is a working site. There's every one of these modules is being worked on. So they place concrete inside this sill. There's another one out over there. And then this edging just breaks off and it gives you a nice concrete edge. Kind of a neat product. That's called, um, I don't know what it's called, Z countertop? Z countertop. countertop. That's, That's what, what that one's one. called. Come on in here, JJ. And uh, radiant flooring going down as well. That's on top of slab radiant. So they put the slab in, they put that radiant on, and then they put a grout on top of that. That's kind of cool. A lot of stacked seams just to speed up construction so we almost panelized a lot of this building and we just screwed right through our ties into some piece of metal inside just to hold everything tight we're good for this how does this one work what? well this here i have no clue <laughs> something to do with brick and there's a lot of that in this booth you're going to see <laughs> this is supposed to be a drive-through all of a sudden they put a slab here it's supposed to represent a street i think Right, what's this radius wall for? We were going to use radius inside for a, a fountain, but they just haven't had time to do it yet. No, There's just yeah. so much going on in this. So let's come around here. Oh, this is cool. This is a room devoted towards a demonstration. So uh, every hour or so, Glenn is uh, delivering uh, ICF uh, coursing and putting together a demonstration. So, uh, nice little spot to show folks how this thing got built. That's the Fox Box demo room. That's the Fox room. Box demo room, yeah. I'll find you when I'm done. Come on. We'll see if they're on fire. I just like standing up. I'm just going to be assistant. Come on. Yeah. So, the live demonstration is going on. This is Stone Edge Surfaces. Uh, they're putting uh, different textures and feels, uh, and this is all going over Fox Blocks, insulated concrete walls, and uh, Concrete Decor Magazine chose us because of the flatness and the EPS density for, for all these finishes. All right, JJ. This is going to be the Harley Davidson shop. Oh, this is cool. So they're doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're inlaying into uh, polished 
polished concrete floors and they're taking the template off and the sticker. Come on, JJ. So that's a great view of it in here. Great view. You've got some uh, exposed Fox Blocks walls over here. And uh, what we've got is uh, uh, this is uh, Fox Blocks walls. Uh, they're not pouring it. They're just using the, uh, the framework. And the nubs are cut off because it's going to be a concrete countertop put on this. So more good stuff. Yeah. We're gonna go take a look at that. So let's go out the front door here and take a look at the. Uh, and for every Fox Box project you use, Davidson. So uh, make sure do your next project with Fox Box. All right, continuing. Yeah, we're, we're continuing go around. So, Glenn, how many rooms are in the building? There's four rooms. We use a full truckload of product. Full trailer load, it's all six inch, and it went eight foot high. Oh, real quick, how did the guys do the banding right here? Was this a foam plant on? That was a piece of foam, yeah, and then they did the spider lath over top of that, screwed it on, and then they just shot the stucco on and smoothed it out. This is a rough texture on here because they're going to do another finish over top yet, so that, this is just the base coat. And that was a single application, so they did that all in one layer. So again, this whole building is a joint effort. All of these finish systems uh, and uh, all of this going over the top of Fox Block. So a lot of times, a lot of times we get asked, hey, what can we finish uh, the, the, the Fox Box walls with? There's a small sampling of what you can do. And take a look at what they did on the floor inside here. This is this is kind of neat. And let's, Randy, let's go down the corridor. We've been to the front. Or is there something to see in the front? Maybe we need to walk over here. Yeah, there is. This 10-minute video. Ask them what they're doing, Randy. Oh, look at this. Also, waterproofing systems. Uh, we get off and ask for all the blow grade applications, what you can use for waterproofing, any peel and stick, roll on, spray on. We just can't hot mop asphalt tar. So here's a good one, multi equip. And here's Clark Ricks, ICF Bullet Magazine. You say hi, Clark. Hi, Randy. Hey, what Glenn. Do you, what do you think about this out here? This is, this is a great opportunity to show uh, attendees at World of Concrete what ICFs are capable of. It's a great demonstration of the wide variety of ex exterior and interior finishes that can be achieved on ICFs. Thank you, Clark. Go to ICF Builder Magazine. Look that up online. That's a great resource. And all of these live demonstrations are happening and all of it going right over Fox Box. So we, uh, we're proud to be part of this effort. Education. Fox Box one. This is Lynn Plus. And that's the Mall of Concrete. So let's walk into the Mall of Concrete. There's still some neat things to see. This is the center court. This is where they were going to use the radius block and do a fountain. And they just ran out of time and space. JJ, come take a look over here. Jason, lead senior estimator. What's the average square foot cost of insulated uh, concrete floors? 15, 16, 17, 18. So 17, 18. in the mid to high <laughs> teens per square Depends foot installed. That is, yeah, that's a, kind of a national average. And uh, take that to the bank.
This is this is the coolest thing. Hey, is this your deal? No. Where is this guy? He should be here. He puts this together and sells it as a unit. You can throw it in the back of your half ton and drive it home. And he's doing he's doing this stuff, which is all done by hand. It's kind of a neat deal. The guy's an artisan. And I don't see him. He's not around. The guy's gone AWOL. So I think we're done. I think so. Is there anything to close with? Uh, we're proud. We're grateful. We are absolutely having a wonderful show here and uh, look forward to talking to you in 2018. Hey, just a sec. Take a look through that window at the guy with the silver hard hat. That guy did all these floors. The guy's got a pretty intense look on his face, like he's working, you know? <laughs> Anyways, I think we're done. That was, that was it, 2018 World of Concrete. We're having a, a whole lot of fun. <laughs> That was a good. That was that a good was length. Twenty minutes. <laughs> oh, that was like ten minutes. Like ten minutes. Was it ten minutes? That's not bad. That's can a you, good one. Can you cut seven minutes out of that?